Hello and welcome to the Indicator Warehouse. In today's quick video, I'm going to be going over how the ultimate support and resistance suite can enhance any day trading system. Now for this demonstration, I am going to be using Diversified Trading Systems or DTS to give you guys a better idea of exactly how the ultimate SNR works. But ultimate SNR, just like solid money management, will work with any day trading system. To tell you a little bit about the ultimate support and resistance, the algorithm was created by Eric Semft and it is designed to work on all time frames as well as futures, stocks, and Forex. Let's go ahead and let's get started. Okay, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna take a look at some of the DTS signals that were given to us here today on July 17th of 2014 for the NASDAQ. Just to keep it simple, all the long signals are going to be denoted by these green hash marks right here. Let's go ahead and let's take a look at this first entry that we have right here. This pink line denotes one of our ultimate support and resistance lines and now it's highlighted with the yellow dots as well. I've got a little bit of room up to the resistance point right here. Here is my entry. I go ahead and I take it and as support and resistance goes, sometimes these lines can be broken like we see right here. Now, let's go ahead and take a look at the median line, which is the orange line right here. I'm gonna call this the center of support and resistance for lack of better words. And I get, of course, yet another signal right here. Again, I've got some room up to resistance right here. And as you can see, price does pull back and rotate around this SNR level, but eventually it stops up here at resistance at 27.50. Let's go ahead and let's take a look at some short signals as well. Once again, we've got a diversified trading system signal right here below our resistance. And although it's a good signal, Perhaps I'm maybe a more conservative trader. Even so, I take the signal right here at 99 and a quarter. You can see where I stop here at this support level here. Now, eventually it breaks through. The more conservative entry would have been with this DTS signal right here, right below my resistance line. And you're gonna notice it gives me lots of room to get down to the next point of support, which is going to be right here. Now, as I mentioned in the blog post, not only can it help you with a more conservative entry, but it can also help you pick out good profit targets as well. Not to mention, maybe, just maybe, you'd wanna use the resistance and place your stop somewhere up above that and hide behind that. Here's another great example of a short trade just below our resistance line right here. And once again, we can use our ultimate support and resistance for a target as well. Not only can you set it up with just lines like I have right here, we can also set up the ultimate support and resistance with the adjustable zone height. In this case right here, I've got it set up to five ticks either side. Well, all right, I hope you found this video to be helpful and informative. And if you have any questions regarding ultimate support and resistance suite, please contact me at ray at indicatorwarehouse.com. Thanks and have a great day.